The Blue Jays season may not have played out as hoped, but the team is turning the Rogers Center into a field of dreams for a select group of young baseball prospects. Debbie Lytle Kwan has that story. They are diamonds in the rough. The best college eligible baseball players in Canada. Scouts watch their every move. There's some good talent up here. There's a lot of, I've got a lot of names that I'm going to be taking back to hopefully call and contact them, get them down to visit and check out our school and see if we're a good fit for them. This is the second ever Tournament 12, part of a commitment by the Blue Jays to develop baseball talent in Canada. Oh God, I mean, this is, um, actually I don't see a difference right now between American players and the Canadian players. Now, there are 160 players here from across Canada. They were selected by the Blue Jays Baseball Academy with help from scouts from the team, from Baseball Canada, and from Major League Baseball. For former Jays pitcher Paul Spaljeric, the tournament hits home. He's coaching and his two oldest sons are playing. It's exciting and nerve-wracking all at the same time. I'm nervous for them. I want them to, to succeed and do well. Uh, but they, what a great opportunity that this, uh, this entire environment provides. I was pretty excited to be here. I mean, it's awesome, obviously, playing on the Rogers Center. That's pretty amazing. It makes it that much more special to be able to say that I pitched on the same mound as my dad did back when he was a kid. Well, not really a kid, but you get my point. For the Skiro family from Stony Creek, it's also a dream in the making, one that began on this field eight years ago. Uh, when I was eight, I threw out the first pitch before a Jays game, and now I get to pitch here, so it's pretty cool. Everything's still very much fresh. Uh, I'll, obviously, the dream is to play in the major leagues. Debbie Lytle-Kwan, CBC News, Toronto.